Hello guys, today is Africa Day and we are celebrating being African which is something that I absolutely love with all my heart. What does being African mean to you? For me it means that I am free to express who I am, I love the skin that I am in, I embrace my accent, I love my culture, I embrace my roots, I am deeply engraved in the culture and where I come from. I'm Shona and in Dinoda Danazo and being African for me means that we have to cook we have to cook we have to eat Africans love to eat we love to be merry we love to be together so I am so lucky enough that Google sent me a meal they didn't ask me to do this I just decided to do it so that we can celebrate together so they sent me a couple of ingredients to cook with Luna Maseko for Africa Day so I am going to be recreating the meal that she made for Africa Day using the ingredients that they sent me. So I hope you guys are actually going to enjoy these earrings that I'm wearing, um, Kenyan earrings. The Duke is I think inspired by Nigeria, Ghana and oh, most of the West African countries and I'm not wearing my Shona regalia because one I don't have it, two I don't think my culture actually has a set um, type of regalia I'm not sure but if there is please correct me in the comment section down below but other than that I'm looking forward to cooking for you guys and cooking with you and chilling so let me show you what I'm going to be using today So because I am going to be following Lona Maseko's Jollof Rice for Africa Day, I want to find out which kind of drinks actually go well with Jollof Rice so that we can try out like some of them. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into my Google app and then I'm just going to ask Google, Hey Google, what drinks go well with Jollof Rice? Here's a summary from Eat Tech Travel. Top 5 drinks to complement jollof rice. Honorable mention, Coca-Cola. Many Nigerians have tried this pairing, I just had to put this up for the nostalgia. Chapman. I would never forget the first awambe, I clearly remember having Chapman with jollof rice. It was in December 2006. I think Google went a little bit overboard. <music> going to do is I'm going to blend uh, a couple of um, ingredients that I have peppers onion garlic and ginger fresh ginger everything is fresh that I'm blending right now so yeah just gonna put it right here and blend it Whilst I'm actually cooking the jollof rice, I am really just following Lona Maseko's video. She made a video about this on her channel where she was cooking jollof rice for Africa Day. And I'm hoping, I am hoping it's gonna come out right.
guys. I'm tired of cooking already. I didn't really realize that jollof fries take so much time. Two hours later. So you guys have seen the food and now it's time for the verdict. Let me taste it. Nice. It actually tastes like jollof. It's jollof mousse. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? It actually tastes like jollof. It's nice. I'm like, it's jollof. Jollof. It's jollof. It's nice. That's how jollof rice tastes like. I've never had it, so <laughs> so you had it. You heard it here first. <laughs> it tastes good. I thought it didn't taste nice. Oh, yeah. Baby, come try, please. Don't disappoint me now. <laughs> no, really, it's nice. Taste, Baba. <laughs> it's refusing to taste my food. So guys, the jollof rice is a hit and a miss in the house. For me, I feel like there's a lot of flavor going in. It will take like a lot of time for me to get used to it. My little sister thinks it's nice. And my sister's boyfriend thinks it's very nice as well. My boyfriend refused to taste. He refused like he refused. It's actually nice, but I think it all, you need to get used to it. It's like an acquired taste. There's a lot of flavor. Very different from biryani. Yeah, it's very different. Very, very different. Maybe it's the texture. I don't know. The texture is the same. Mostly. I don't know. But rice, it's not the same rice that you use for biryani, isn't it? But biryani, you use, you use um, uh, freaking rice like jasmine or basmati. You use basmati. Hi, bo. She didn't use basmati mousse. She used the same rice. That's nice. It's not the same. I okay. Jesus. Don't disappoint me. Is this how no. you gonna be like when they say try, try, try something? And then you be like, I don't want to try it. Have you tasted try? It's not for me. What's for you, bruh? Cosad. Have you tasted sad? What's that? Sad. Mm -hmm. Pap. Mm -hmm. Pap, yeah, a pap. Did you like it? No. Look, he's nervous <laughs> now. He's nervous. <laughs> <laughs> it's not an easy.